Well, this first Monday in spring certainly feeling like spring with temperatures getting well above average. More like late spring. We're in the mid 60s for our daytime highs today. Normal average high more like mid 50s. And we're still in the 60s in many spots. Even as we head into the 6 o'clock hour, it's still feeling fairly mild. 63 out of Beckley and 64 checking in for reading in Lewisburg. Tonight we're going to drop down into those 40s, but those clouds are on the rise as we head into our Tuesday. That's ahead of our next system. We have high pressure out there right now, so we've had those gorgeous blue skies all day. But our next system is not far off, and nor is the cloud cover. Over parts of Kentucky, we're starting to see those high and mid-level clouds. That rain well off to the west, that won't reach us until closer to Wednesday morning, but we will continue to watch that. Those rain chances, once they do hit us, are really sticking with us. We're going to have an active pattern heading into the weekend. So heading into Wednesday is when we have our highest rainfall chances, maybe at very late Tuesday night, but it's really heading towards the weekend that we're watching some pretty on and on again, off again sort of shower activity uh, as we head over the next uh, three to five days. But before we get there, clouds on the rise tomorrow, we'll still see breaks of sun. It's really not until very late Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, we see that rain, some of it heavy at times in those yellows and oranges. And then we see some breaks in the in those clouds and those uh, pockets of rain as we head into a Wednesday afternoon and then th into Thursday we start to clear on out. We have a cold front move on through and we'll see some clearing and cooler temperatures as well heading towards the weekend. There is a minor severe threat not on Tuesday, but as we head into Wednesday, that's when we do see our level one threat, which is a marginal threat. It's the lowest threat issued. And generally, we're just looking at gusty winds for most of the area. Those winds will start to gust as the system nears closer going into tomorrow out of the southeast, upwards of 30 miles per hour. So we'll get a little gusty Tuesday night and then heading into Wednesday when that final push of that that rain is moving on through, we'll start to see uh, that wind out of the southeast gusting closer to 40 miles per hour. So we could see some of those isolated power outages. It doesn't look like flooding is going to be a big issue because generally this rain is going to be very scattered. Everywhere we'll see the rain, but not everywhere we'll see the same amounts. Most places will not reach an inch through Thursday. Uh, most places will not necessarily get to a half an inch out of the Beckley area. We're less than that and Bluefield as well. Oak Hill could potentially see a little bit more, but nowhere is really getting near an inch of rainfall, so we're not too concerned there. The temperature staying mild all the way through. 60s heading into tomorrow, and then we're going to be near 70 at, in spots as we head into a Wednesday. Then we cool down, heading towards the weekend. Remember, it is still March, and Mother Nature is making sure to remind us of that, heading towards the weekend. Janine.